Welcome to the second video of lesson 1 Grand MA2 software. In this video I will show you how to make a network connection between Grand MA2 on PC and Grand MA 3D visualization software. I, would I will also show you how to patch moving lights inside Grand MA and how to give coordinates to the spots in your 3D environment. Okay, let's have a look at Windows network environment. You go to this uh, sign or the wireless sign, right mouse click, open network area. Uh, you see I have a connection with the internet and with a uh, uh, server. Let's have a look in the settings. This is the place where all your network connections are visible. You see I'm connected with the local area network. Um, the IP address is just automatically assigned. It works for me now. If you don't have a connection or a good connection available, then you should make a virtual local area network connection, a virtual adapter, and that's called a Microsoft Lubeck adapter. You can uh, Google it and you will find a tutorial how to add it to this environment. Um, if you have a Lubeck adapter, you can share, you can make a virtual space where GrandMA2 on PC talks with GrandMA 3D visualization software. So, I disabled all these ones. I always do it when I have a connection and it's really important that it stays working and it works in one time. I go to MA Network Control. But before you see this window, you need to go to Setup. And then you say MA Network Control. Here is some information about this computer. You see the IP address. If you want to change the IP address, you can do that in this area. Because I disabled all the other ones, it takes the, the most above one. But if you have different different adapters available, then you should check that it really takes the, the right one. This is the IP address of uh, uh, the router where where I'm connected to. So I say session name. Let's name it um, tutorial YouTube. Press enter. Um, you can make a password but it's not necessary for this situation. Um, ID just leave it like one. That's okay. Then you say create session and now it will stream information over the network adapter that I just selected so we close this one and we start up the software grant MA 3d it's here right here it's very important that you have the same software version as the grant MA 2 on PC When it starts, uh, you can see your IP address right here. If it's not the right one, just click it, click it, and select another one in the list. Here you see my loopback adapter. So this one would be visible if you add it to the right environment. But I take this one because I also selected this one in the Grand MA2 software. Now I can see tutorial YouTube here. You select it and then the join option comes available. You see if it's not selected it will stay grey so it's very important you select it first and then you press join. He asks you if I want to show, save the show but I didn't do anything so no. 
it takes a while, but then you see um, pumping green heart here. That's the sign that you have a good connection. Everything I do now on the Grand MA software will happen here in this environment.